folks welcome to dev diary number 57 and eventful summer i am sorry i missed the last couple one was about modding and one was sort of a prelude to this one um uh, this one has some real meat to it it's it's a very thin slice of meat but it's some real meat so in this lovely dev diary we get a introduction and a little bit of a talk about the azure patch which is going to hit sometime before summer vacation they're hoping which summer vacation usually goes from the end of june to the end of july for paradox so we're going to look at one area of the patch which is childhood and lifestyle events for childhood which i think is absolutely wonderful because i don't know about y'all but if i get stuck playing a child in ck3 right now it's literally just go to five speed and just chill unless you're in a war just sort of chill because there's not a whole lot to do so i'm very glad to see that children and childhood is getting some love so the first part we're getting is meet peers, which is essentially a throwing a feast, but for your kids. So your kids get a play date and there can be all sorts of great things that happen, such as you finding someone's brave. Uh, of course, this poor kid is getting some stress from it. Uh, and then there's also some terrible ones that apparently it looks like we're going to be possibly able to hurt someone or someone gets hurt. Not a great thing, but you know. It, it happens sometimes when kids play, especially when they play without adult supervision. Uh, and then here we go, we have some lifestyle events. So if your children can't wait to grow up, you can do things like have a little tournament, which is apparently based on a myth about Richard III being a child king when he wasn't. Uh, yeah, but we, uh, <laughs> you can throw a tournament and have your child try to beat up all of their nobles because one noble wants to hit their child king <laughs> or queen i suppose depending on how you're doing gender and everything in your empire uh yeah will you allow your baby's first bloodlust be unleashed upon your knights who certainly did not sign up for this i think the answer folks is always always yes and this is only a little tiny snippet but you know, we're going to have more, I would assume. This is a free patch. And the fact that they're advertising a free patch and we know that they will be announcing a DLC at PDXCon makes me wonder, especially because they've promised that this will come out or they really hope it will come out. They haven't promised. They're really hopeful that it'll come out before summer vacation. Makes me wonder if the DLC will be coming out before summer vacation, which that means we'll get another CK3 DLC in June, maybe. That's my hypothesis. I know nothing for sure. I wish I did, but I don't. And actually, even if I did know for sure, I probably would not be allowed to say anything about it. <laughs> um, yeah. But that's my hypothesis at the moment. And honestly, I if with these new events, I'll probably try and do a run where we start as a child and see what can happen. Here's a closer look at the events. We have Meet Peers, which is... Uh, what do you say, children? Think you can handle the basics? Oh, we're going to teach them something. Yes, I would rather watch you train. Apparently this kid is maybe a coward and they really don't want to, but they're going to. Uh, we have playing rough. I thought Ood's the son of my steward and the peasant boy were merely pretending to fight, but suddenly there's blood in the dirt. Ood's hits the ground with a grunt and the peasant standing above him moves to attack again. So we can save him with blues of stress. Someone please help. Uh, or we can become a bully and make him our victim. Yeah, so you get a little more control with that bully event, it appears. You don't have to become a bully. Uh, here's our tantrum tur tourney. Father, may I fight around in the fray? Oh, so this is, this is not even just your character when you're the ruler, but your children, if you're an adult ruler, could do something like this. You could allow them to go beat up your knights. And this dev diary was from Heptopus, <laughs> who's a content designer and has been for a while. So more events are always welcome. Yes, I'm, I'm liking the responses. Like we've got 72 upvotes, 13 loves, 11 helpfuls. There's no downvotes currently for this dev diary, which makes me very happy. Only rulers will be able to hold the activity, but your child might be invited to, for an example, a fellow vassal's play date with vassal's child. So just like you can, you know, be invited to your vassal's uh, feasts, your children can be invited to your vassal's play dates, which I think is quite nice. 
Uh, are there ways for add additional personality events? No, we have no concrete plans for this, but I agree that more variety is always fun. Thank you for suggestions. It's always great to see. Yes, we always need more. We always, always, always can use more fun, helpful role play events. Anything else the devs have said to us here? Nope, that's it. Those are the two dev responses. But I think I'm pretty hopeful. How do you guys feel? What do you think about this uh, free little patch that will be coming out this summer? Uh, I think, you know, more content, more fleshing out is always good. And if it's free, it's the best. But thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this and you'd like to help support me, please feel free to check out my Patreon. Link is in the description box down below. And if you're new here, well, you know, you can hit that little subscriber button, ring that bell. And as always, hit the thumbs up whether you're new or not. And I'll see y'all around. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Bye, guys.